जय श्री राम इन दी एटीन चैप्टर ऑफ द भगवद गीता श्री कृष्णा डिक्लेयर्स दैट बाय डूइंग योर ड्यूटी यू विल बी वर्शिपिंग द क्रिएटर बाय सिंपली डूइंग योर ड्यूटी बिकॉज वी ऑल आर स्पक्स ऑफ द सेम डिमाइन we are all the rays of hiranya garbha we are all the rays of the sun we are all the rays of the shakti called krishna so we are part and parcel of him though of course we are infinitesimal whereas he is infinite so krishna is declaring by just doing your duty you will be worshiping me and swakarmana tam abhyacha siddhim vindati manava so just by doing your duty you will achieve perfection so yatta pravruttir bhutanam yena sarvam idam tatam swakarmana tam abhyacha siddhim vindati manava so there are many idiots uh, many western indologists and many so called reformers of hindu society these rascals have, have no knowledge of sanskrit no knowledge of vedic sanskrit and they have read the translations of uh, <laughs> all those western rascals uh, who have a simple agenda to christianize uh, the whole of india even raja ram mohan roy he was not a raja to begin with he wrote lengthy letters to queen victoria that hinduism cannot be reformed and only christianity can save india so queen victoria sent this fellow's letters to another uh, rascal and that fellow was uh, macaulay macaulay's mind started working so he has he hatched a plot he realized that uh, if we can destroy the indian education system uh, then uh, we will uh, be able to impose english which is a cultural bomb and we must make hindus feel ashamed of their own religion so then he started the education system our gurukula system was uprooted and that rascal macaulay also introduced the indian penal code <laughs> which we are still living by so finally this is how they all ganged up eh? and missionary started doing the schooling for us huh? uh, so this is the whole conspiracy and uh, nowhere in the vedas or in the bhagavad gita krishna is discriminating eh? there is no discrimination anywhere hinduism teaches you that krishna rama god brahman is there in every human being in every animal in every plant so how did we end up eating meat uh, obviously because we have imitated those idiots and rascals uh, these mlechas uh, so we as a hindu you should not eat meat that is uh, the worst kind of uh, papam sin is a silly christian concept so i don't want to use that word so just by doing your duty so if you are a brahmin do your duty that is provided you have the aptitude you may be born in a brahmin family but uh, maybe you don't have the aptitudes of a brahmin what are the aptitudes of a brahmin reading teaching spiritualizing the society so how you spiritualize is up to you if you can study the way when there is no spirituality in the other holy books spirituality doesn't exist in the desert cults so spirituality how do you define it the search for self knowledge there is no self knowledge there only dogma knowledge you have to blindly believe whatever rubbish they teach you so that is what a brahmin does kshatriya administration protection vaishya business and farming shudra all kinds of services or skilled work so there is nothing higher or lower so if you whatever your aptitudes are you may be born in a brahmin family but you may have the aptitudes of a shudra or you may be born in a shudra family but may have the aptitudes of a brahmin so according to your aptitudes your guna hmm, then you start seeking out because varna vri means to choose the word varna root is vri vri means to choose so you choose whatever profession you want if you have the aptitude but if you don't have the aptitude you will be a round peg in a square hole so <laughs> that will be stupid you cannot achieve excellence unless you have aptitude for an activity जय श्री राम यत्त प्रवृत्तिर्भूता सर्वदम ततम स्वकर्मणात अभ्यच सिद्धि विंदति मानवा सो बै पर परसूइंग युअर ड्यूटी यू कैन अचीव परफेक्शन एंड मोक्षा कैन देर बी एनी नोबलर मेसेज देन दिस एनी वेर जय श्री राम